I realized that there should be more about trees than just timber. They are able to taste the saliva of animals, for example, of deers or of certain caterpillars. When they taste that, they recognize, ah, there's a deer uh, feeding on me, uh, and then they pump poisonous substances in the branches and in the leaves, and in the same time, warning the surrounding neighbor trees by chemicals, and then the neighbor trees realize, ah, there's a danger approaching, and which danger is approaching? The scientists have found out that oak trees have more than 600 different six signals. It's something like 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 uh, our speech. I think it's it's uh, another problem why we don't hear about that, because it's uh, that trees are communicating um, among each other is known since uh, more than 20 years. That's a long time. But I think it's it's about uh, categorizing nature. Um, first category is uh, mankind. Uh, the, the second category are animals. The third category are plants. And the third category, plants, it's like a bad category, a category where we can treat living beings like raw material. So we don't have that big research being done on plants like on animals. But that, that changes in the moment. And for example, when you see that uh, in the Swiss constitution, the plant rights are mentioned. There is a change going on, and I think and within the next year, we will years, we will hear uh, very much news about uh, how plants are working, and we will see that plants and animals and humans are not that different that we thought about. Mm -hmm.